Hello everyone, so welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today in this video we are going to study stored procedure in SQL. A stored procedure is a prepared SQL code that uh, you store using some procedure so that uh, so the code can be reused over and over again. So uh, what is stored procedure? Stored procedure is a collection of SQL statement and that is stored inside the database and what we need we can use it again and again. So basically uh, why we use store procedure, store procedure for example uh, we are using some SQL statement on daily basis and we need to write on uh, daily basis over and over again. So instead of writing on daily basis we uh, we make it, uh, we uh, store into it, we store this all statement using some procedure and whenever we need we just call it and execute it. So in store procedure you can pass some parameter as well and uh, you can pass parameter to a store procedure so that store procedure can act based on the parameter value. So syntax of this uh, delimiter has as so uh, in why we use delimiter basically in syntax basically in SQL by default delimiter is semicolon. So, uh, in a uh, store procedure, we write to multiple uh, statements, and if we will use semicolon after each uh, statement, so it will understand like uh, now query has been ended and it will execute it. But by defining this delimiter and using some symbol, we are telling to the compiler like until and unless you will not get this symbol again you have to consider all the group of statement into this single statement so now uh, delimit we uh, we have uh, so now uh, we will write delimiter and you can put any symbol here you can put uh, double slash as well and ampersand as well so you can give any symbol here and uh, after that we will create we will write create procedure and procedure name whatever procedure name you want to uh, you want to give you can give here and then uh, we will pass some parameters so in sq uh, so in store procedure there is three parameter in out and in out so uh, like these are written in square bracket it means it's optional you can give or you if you can pass this parameter otherwise you can put it blank as well just you can write create procedure procedure name and round bracket open and round bracket close and then begin and here uh, you can write your statements whatever statement you want to write you can write here and then we will end using this symbol and we'll put this symbol here and after that delimiter and semicolon so now uh, we see example of in so in store so there are three type of parameter uh, in out and in out so in basically it's a default parameter and it only receive the value from the program so we'll write in this way delimiter double hash and create procedure procedure name here i gave procedure name p1 and uh, i write input in and then where uh, and then parameter name and data type data type int begin select star from student where student id equals to this so here i want to see all the detail of the student where student id and you can give any id like suppose that you want to see uh, all the detail of the student id too so whenever you will execute this query call when you will call call procedure you can give student id number here like suppose that you want to see all the detail of the student id 6 so you can uh, pass the parameter 6 and you will get all the detail all the dealer of student having or having student id 6 an example of out so out basically what does it return output of the program so we'll write uh, in this way delimiter double has create procedure procedure name we will write out and then uh, parameter name and data type and then begin so here i want to uh, see total count of the student who belong from 
Delhi city. So I will write in this is select count from student where city equals to Delhi. So where I want so uh, like whatever count it will give I want to store into this variable. So here I mentioned select count star into total count. I want to store total count into this variable. So and I will execute this query in this with call procedure name and I will write the pair I will give pair, uh, I will call using this variable you can give any variable basically what it will does it will it will uh, it will call this parameter and like when a select count basically it store the value into this and this value it's it will store into in this so it will execute according to that and after that after calling this uh, after writing this call procedure this we will see the result using select statement select and you can give variable name here example of in out basically the combination of both in and out it will it receive value as well as it's return the value so here uh, I will write like uh, delimiter double has create procedure procedure name in out variable and int so here I set variable name well equals to well plus 2 and I will end and delimiter I will write delimiter with semicolon and, and now I will execute so while we will execute I will set variable value 0 and now I will call call procedure procedure name at well 3 so now here uh, variable value is 0 so now it will give 0 value 0 plus 2 2 now it and it will return when I will write select it will it will when I will write select variable name it will return 2 again when I will execute this now the variable value has set 2 and 2 plus 2 4 it will give me 4 value now it and the value has been 4 so now again i will call this 4 plus 2 6 so in this way it will return the value so i hope it's clear to you and uh, thank you so much for watching me bye bye